it's my channel i'm not letting anyone post nonsense in the comments they have no ties or roots here without reciprocity there is no relationship so i'm kicking them the fuck out if i tolerate it i'm complacent tactical approval leads to endless fucking failure that's i keep saying this I see how when people have their reality challenged, they can't hold focus, their low attention span, especially if it's not on their radar. They're locked in on their own little bubble, skipped over to the next. But then they watch hours on end of issues that have absolutely nothing to do with helping their current situations that are on growing and building up. It's insane if the house is burning down and someone's like, no, it's not. That's, it's insane. You gotta, you gotta be headed, you gotta be ahead of the game know how to survive out of the system we're living in or live in it and take whatever comes I don't know how any no one's seeing the first like the first steps to communism was take control of speech change laws endlessly The only thing left now is take guns. And then the real crap will go down. Already, if you disagree, you're looked at as unacceptable. But in the same breath, they say they have your best interests. And they're there for you. And how can people forget how many genocides have happened under communism? So how's that working out for us so far? Most would rather give up their freedom, their give up their rights. For freedom. It seems like a, a very large amount of the next generation is having no ethical values as the millstoning only is getting worse with the little ones god have mercy on us man when you follow the golden rule jesus said there is no loopholes hence why i say not making the cut as their words don't match by what they don't do but the division from those who have faith will be rejected from society or because they're already not fitting in to the system <coughs> the people will be outcasts and the outcasts will have many different groups from the looks of it there will be division it's already started not seeing it happening from so many different directions I don't know it's instant I don't get it It'd be a good idea to start somewhere. Ask God to help me have better eyes and ears to know who's who. 
I now understand. I now know and understand. There can be no blurring the lines. If they're loving and brother, if they're not a loving brother and sister, don't divorce them. We can't have right relationships without reciprocity. When there is no love. You have to give as good as you get. But the point of this is, if we don't give back, I mean, if we, if we don't have a backup plan with each other, and helping each other, the odds are even more against us when you're in small numbers. I'm not always nice, and I don't trust anyone that says they are. Yeah, I have a history of making bad decisions, bad ideas, but I'm damn sure I'm not wrong on a backup plan. Like I said, a lot of people are showing their true colors. Where are we going to go? Are people going to start to have critical thinking? Or just sit and watch hours and then have other content that's absolutely useless? There's certain things that you can't tolerate. Drunks and addicts are one of them. It's too easy to have all these unpredictable people. Like they don't. Nothing that they say matches what they do. What they do. So if they treat you like dog shit, then they gotta move on. Move up from a distance. But it'd be definitely crucial to think about yourself and your own family. Especially with the way the state of things are. Much love you guys.